All right, we're already getting a bit of Chris oh. Porter's comedy. He was born and raised just a few hours down the road in uh, Kansas City. Chris has spent a lot of time on the road, especially since finishing third on season four of Last Comic Standing. There he is. He's going to be at the Funny Bone this weekend. Chris, good to see you. Nice hey. to have you here. That's good, good to be here. Some That's good great, private talk. Great conversation. Yeah, that was a good conversation. We're, I'm so much funnier off air. Yeah. <laughs> I guess. There are certain um, things you can't really say once we're live. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, yeah. you can say them, but then you have to pay trouble. some serious, serious fines. We get it. Nice to see you. To see it's it. a pleasure to be here. Last coming standing. I mean, is that where people, a lot of people know? You? Nice bell bottoms too, by the way. I've yep, yeah. rocking the bells. Is that, is that is that a new thing? That's is that no. Like I'm old thing? school. Well, it's kind of my. I don't like. I hate skinny jeans. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so it, I wanted to go the exact opposite. Can we yeah. stick with your apparel? Uh, you have had a royal sweatshirt on. Yep. You've got the KC T-shirt. Yep. Proud I'm of the hometown. Are you watching shirts? the Royals right now? Heck yeah, I'm watching mm -hmm. the Royals. I bought the package. I can watch it on my phone. Great. And then I just yell out curse words in the middle of public places. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're uh, in the middle of uh, some good stuff here. Right? I mean, you feel good? Yeah, it's good taken this? 30 years. Mm -hmm. yeah, you feel and good I've about been this? a fan ever since. So it's I feel good. It's scary. Yeah. You know, uh, but I'm glad that it's September yeah. and we're playing games that mean something. Mm -hmm. You yeah. know, usually by this time, over the last 20 years, like yeah. the, the the players are in like the outfield smoking, <laughs> like they're on their phone, the lawn chair. Yeah, yeah. Like Billy Butler, is, like only plays the first three innings, <laughs> yeah. and then he has to go eat. <laughs> what about football? You watching the Chiefs? I watch the Chiefs, but they. You know, through the 90s, they just broke my heart mm. so many. It's like that ex-girlfriend that keeps coming back and is like, I've changed. You know she hasn't. <laughs> so I watch them, but I, I don't. You're not invested. I, I'm, I bleed blue. You're a bigger yeah, Royals I get it. Fan. Absolutely. I get it. Hey, I was, I was talking about Todd and Tyler. Uh, I, was, I was listening to you on the Todd and Tyler Radio Empire show yesterday morning. You're on today, too, right? Yes, yeah. And I'm and probably going to go back. They have run me ragged. I know, but you said, I think you tweeted something about Todd and Tyler, because you, yeah. you said you do 50 radio interviews a year. Yes. And Todd and Tyler, one of the best. The best. They're just so, uh, maybe it's because I'm from this area. Yeah. Uh, but I just feel most at home with Todd and Tyler. Mm -hmm. They're great guys. They're very funny, and uh, they get it. They're not. Mm -hmm. They don't make me get up there and do bits or yeah. anything. We just yeah, go up there just, and talk. Just and talk about breathe. stuff. Yeah. Uh, last comic standing. It's been a few years. It's but been eight years. Yeah, isn't that crazy? It's been. But I, been I, a president. <laughs> after that experience, uh, you had said that it was both great and weird. Mm -hmm. What was weird about the success that came from the show or the notoriety? Well, yeah, it? I mean, it's one day you're just some guy telling jokes in a bar, and then the next thing you know, you're walking out Sunset Boulevard, and people are going, Willie Walker! <laughs> just like, that's weird. Right. You know, your yeah. friend's going, okay, I can't hang out with you anymore. <laughs> So yeah, I mean that's that's a nuts thing to like go from absolute anonymity uh -huh. to having people yelling weird things at you as you try to go get lunch. Yeah, you you look different. You're very well groomed, mm -hmm. well manicured. You see yeah. some stuff from you where it was yeah. just hair all over the place. Well, that was up until about two months ago, and you know eventually you look in the mirror and you go, hey man, you're 35, and uh, maybe you should deal with that. <laughs> <laughs> well, why cut why cut your hair? How does that help you deal with it? Uh, well, I, you know, I look like I might have a clue at this point. <laughs> uh, you know, at the end of the day, I just got tired of dealing with it. Look at that. Yeah. Look at bird's nest. Like that. And that was a good day. <laughs> look at that. that. That was, that was good hair <laughs> on that day. And that, that happened once a month. That's awesome. Most of the time, I just looked like I escaped some I sort of a You look better like this. No, you look I good do. with short hair. Yeah, no, the I girls, like see, like, it's very funny. I didn't realize how ugly I was until I cut it. And like girls I've known for years are like, so what are you doing later? Are you, like, oh, are you kidding? <laughs> Do you have more ladies now or what's going on? Well, I mean, I'm not Mormon, but uh, <laughs> I, uh, I, they're definitely more uh, attentive than they were before. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Hey, we'll show your uh, show times here in a second, but I read quickly. Um, do you have a new album? I do. It's on out? Netflix called yeah. Ugly and Angry. Uh -huh. It's available now, and uh, I'll be selling vinyl copies of it at the I show. I heard about that. Yeah, awesome. vinyl copies. Yeah, blue vinyl. That's yeah, I heard you talking about that with great. Tom Tyler. Uh, so, several shows. You've got five total between tonight, tomorrow, I and Sunday. Uh, the number there on the screen that's the bone phone. It's 493 8036. <laughs> or you can get tickets online at funnybonomaha.com. That's her favorite part of this whole interview. I didn't name it. Bone phone? Yeah, that's her favorite well, part. I didn't come up with that's what they call it. That's why I'm gonna start calling my phone. <laughs> <laughs>
Chris. Great. Great. Chris Porter. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, Pleasure. Chris. Uh, <laughs> Good stuff.